one more lightning talk by Dix, who, uh, who very generously uh, suggested that he will use I, what I we suggested. found <laughs> backstage. <laughs> and God knows he, 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 he knows how dog. to play. <laughs> so. <laughs> Hopefully that's the nice end of the day and a reward for all of you who decided to stay so late and survive. It's a bigger computer. Hello, hello. <laughs> hello, 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 hello. Hello, hello. Is my hello. Working? All right. No. Oh, uh, <laughs> yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll put that up in a second because we're gonna show a couple slides. But um, yeah, I can do that part. Thank you. Um, hey, I'm Johnny Diggs. Uh, I uh, I uh, am really happy to be here, and I was really happy to see this thing. This is the biggest piano I've ever seen. Um, so four things really quickly before we party. Uh, I, everyone has said, and I agree, this has been an awesome conference, and I think the whole um, Applicate team, and you guys come on stage because you guys have done such a fantastic, come on. Come on. Stick around here for a second, because we'll all... We'll, we'll, uh, uh, thing two, I need to do a shameless plug. I work for Tropo. I'm the chief technology evangelist. Uh, if you don't know what Tropo is, uh, it makes it excruciatingly, excruciatingly easy for developers to uh, make apps for the phone and SMS apps. Um, anybody here of Adhesion? It's a Ruby framework for uh, developing phone apps. We're one of the, the, the lead uh, contributors to Adhesion. Um, so if you've never checked out Tropo, please check it out. Also, uh, they were the biggest sponsor, uh, the Sugar Daddy sponsor, I think they called it. Uh, um, they believed in us way before anybody knew that it's actually going to be in a like, conference. <laughs> uh, so and even I didn't know you were going to call it Sugar Daddy when I contacted you. <laughs> um, it was funny. <laughs> but uh, anyway, uh, I, I love this conference. I want to be able to come back. So if you can at least tweet some thanks to Tropo, it'll make everybody back in the States uh, want to do this again and at the max sign up for an account and build an app and uh, make us a million dollars. Uh, um, think three, uh, a less shameless plug, I am also the founder of Geeks Without Bounds. It's a nonprofit organization that helps people in times of crisis. We also have an accelerator that helps uh, humanitarian startups get going. Uh, a few of the projects that we do uh, twice a year we do random hacks of kindness. It's an international uh, hackathon. It, the next one's coming up in June. I encourage you to uh, sign up or start one in your local town. Um, there, it's an amazing, uh, 4,000 developers have participated in the last five. Um, this weekend in 24 different cities, the International Space Apps Challenge is happening. We're one of the organizers of that. Um, it's it's uh, started by NASA, the European Space Agency is involved, um, and you can build apps for space. There's actually a couple apps that, um, it's, it's like 24 cities, including uh, the, the station down in Antarctica, and there's hackers are going to be on the International Space Station at the same time. Um, so find, it's happening all over the world. If you, can't, if you can't find one in your city, there's virt you can virtually do it. Uh, International Space, or it's called spaceappschallenge.com. Org. Um, the third thing is Startup World. 36 cities, uh, pitch competitions. Um, it, right now they're accepting applications for South America. They're going to be hitting Europe next fall. Um, it's a 
par partnered with the Next Web, um, IO Ventures, and uh, about 15 different uh, startup type entrepreneurial groups. Uh, so check out Startup World. Thing four is shameless singing. <laughs> Can I, before you start, because yes. I have a feeling that once you're done, then everybody will be just... <laughs> I have a list, because I'm not right. that organized. Oh, I lost the list. <laughs> so while we're already here, and I did not expect us to be here, you hide it from me? No. <laughs> um, so I want to I wanna thank all of you. And we, have a, we had a nice presentation to say thank you to our sponsors, but you know who they are, they're on the website. They are amazing and we would not, I, as I told you, have pulled it off with, without uh, them. We would have not done it without you. I want to say special thanks to that uh, woman in red over there who made um, an amazing job. Isa, who's not he here, she, had, she was also trying to protect her personal life and she went to the, to the theater tonight. So she's joining us later for the party. Soha, who is the designer, she's in Ecuador right now, but she's really regretting that she's not here yet. But they've been doing an amazing job. And uh, Piotrek, where's Piotrek? Matusz Piewicz. Oh, oh, because he's sitting up. Can you tell the guys from the like up there from the registration to come downstairs? <laughs> yeah, because they're taking care of the T-shirts right now. <laughs> and yeah, we should say thank you to everyone. We, we, we thought we would announce another event we were doing in November, October, which is a mobile event. Oh, the, here's Emmy who designed the, the mobile application, the demonstration. <laughs> and, and Carol, who had to together, he was doing the website at 3, 4 a.m. Everybody has been doing that. So it matters so much because most of guys who have been doing that after hours, and here's Basha, yeah, so... Uh, <laughs> not only Applicate, it's also Future Simple, and it's right now Predictive, which is our new product, and we're doing so many things, and so there are so many different things going on here, but the kind of unifying spirit is that we like to have fun, we love people like you, we love events like that, and it's just really nice to be on that stage and thank you and I will, we should probably leave the stage right now because what he's you going to do is way more impressive. Thank you again. What time is it? <laughs> it's eight o'clock on a Friday. The regular crowd shovels in. There's an old man sitting next to me, making love to his tickety. La la di di da. You guys sing la la di di da. a song, you're the piano man, sing us a song tonight, well we're all in the mood for a melody, and you got us feeling alright, hey who's feeling alright? <laughs> well if you're not, tonight go see John at the bar, he's a friend of mine, he gets me and my drinks for free, and he's quick with a joke, or to light up your smoke. But there's some place that he'd rather be. He says, Diggs, I believe this is killing me. Has a smile run right away from his face. Well, I'm sure that I could be a Rails programmer if I could get out of this place. La la la. La la. Paul is an O'Reilly media novelist who never had time for a wife. And he's talking with Susan, who programs in Cold Fusion, and probably will be for life. And the waitress is practicing politics as the businessmen slowly get stoned. Yes, they're sharing a drink they call loneliness, but it's better than coding in PHP. <laughs> It's 
a pretty good crowd for Railsbury. It's a pretty quiet crowd at Railsbury. It's a pretty good crowd at Railsbury. And Ella gives me a smile. Cause she knows it wasn't me you were coming to see. To forget about life for a while. And the piano sounds like a carnival. And the microphone smells like beer. Say, man, what are you doing here in Poland? La 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 di di da. La la di di da da da. All right. I'm sure everybody's finished your beer by now. But if you've got one, I need you to hold it up in the air. I need you to take your other arm and put it around the person next to you. Go ahead. This is why Billy Joel wrote this song. And now I need everyone to commence swaying and sing. Sing us the song. Sing us the song Love is all you need. Love is all you need. 